Yeah, Jody, we're in Borough Park, which was home to both victim and killer. It was the epicenter of grief when eight-year-old Levy Kletsky went missing and outrage when he was found murdered just days later. Now there's fresh salt in the wound tonight as this community is dealing with the defense being put forward by Levy Aaron's attorney that he is insane because he is inbred. It's a simple case. He's either evil or he's crazy, and we intend to prove that he was crazy. Attorney Howard Greenberg is ready to be hated for his client while trying to defend confessed child killer Levy Aaron. And he's choosing a most unorthodox defense in the most religious of communities, that Aaron is insane because he is inbred. Whether or not his biological antecedents were uh, blood relations of one another. So you're talking about first cousin yeah, exactly. creating with first cousin. Yeah, exactly, that kind of thing. Greenberg is uh, a miserable, self-hating Jew as far as I'm concerned. The reaction to this defense strategy has been strong and swift from the ultra-Orthodox Jewish community. We have gotten the threats, yes. He wants to defend Levi Aaron. He has every right to do that. But to attack, insult, degrade an entire community, my community, anybody's community, that's not what this case is all about. 35-year-old Levy Aaron is accused of kidnapping, then murdering and dismembering 8-year-old Levy Kletsky last July while the boy made his first attempt to walk home alone from day camp. Aaron has appeared catatonic at recent court hearings. Greenberg says it shows he is criminally insane. It's a perfect storm when you combine traumatic brain injury with schizophrenia uh, that can harbinge random heinous acts of violence. It's an attempt to sort of make us forget the tragedy. Let's concentrate on the inbreeding. Let's concentrate on the insanity defense. Let's concentrate on everything but the facts of the horror that was committed by Levy Aaron. Now, Aaron's attorney argued unsuccessfully to try to get this trial moved out of Brooklyn, where it has had such a polarizing response. The trial now is not expected to begin for about another year or more. I'm in Borough Park, Brooklyn tonight. Kirsten Cole, PIX11 News, now to McGee Hickey. In the lawyer for the man accused of killing and dismembering an eight-year-old boy is drawing criticism for remarks he made in defense of his client. Attorney Howard Greenberg said Levy Aaron had suffered a serious head injury as a kid and his family has a history of schizophrenia during a hearing to see if Aaron is mentally fit to stand trial. Greenberg also suggested that inbreeding was to blame for Aaron's mental problems. A local lawmaker said that suggestion is offensive to the entire Hasidic community. It is very painful to the Kletsky family, very painful to the entire community, uh, the behavior of this attorney. Greenberg says his words were taken out of context and for his part apologized to those who were offended, but said via phone interview that when it comes to Aaron's mental state, he has to explore all avenues. We would be remiss, particularly on the recommendation of medical experts that we've talked to, if we did look into whether or not there's a familial uh, genetic component here. Aaron is accused of luring Leiby Kletsky to his home where he drugged him before killing him and cutting up his body in July. The judge ruled Aaron was mentally fit to stand trial. Lawyers are due back in court in March.